got Kevin McAlvin, 97 pounds of fanatic. Who could the Phillies out of the bat? Well, you know, the, the big name is being talked about is Hunter Pence. Uh, that's, that's one option. Uh, as far as, you know, Josh Willingham might be another option. As far as what the Phillies can do as far as the salary situation, it's going to be interesting. I mean, they're already over $170 million as it is, so adding a lot more payroll on this team, and, you know, it's something that Ruben, I don't think, has too much flexibility with. So, as of right now, I don't really know exactly what direction they're going to go. I think they're just going to rise the way things are now. I mean, they've got the best record in baseball already, so they're doing something right. I think they're going to ride with this for a while, and it's going to come to go. If Emmanuel wants the heading and tomorrow wants the pitching, who gets the side? Well, I think it's a good question. I mean, I think they're both sort of uh, on the same team, but obviously Charlie being the hitting guy that he is, I think Charlie definitely wants to add some offensive firepower. You see the team you know, scoring one, two, three runs a night, getting five or six hits. Uh, so I think Charlie definitely wants it, but the big question mark now is the bullpen. What are they going to do with the back end of that bullpen? Ryan Madsen obviously on the DL now, so uh, I think it's going to be a little tug of war, and I think they're going to sort of put some feelers out on both ends as far as hitting and, and pitching. But uh, yeah, that'll be one to keep your eye on. Who, uh, you know, well, it's going to be a while for Brad Lynch. We're not going to see him probably until uh, probably late July, maybe early August. So right now he's going to go with Antonio Pizarro and Michael Stewart. He's going to sort of play the uh, play the matchups. See uh, as far as the two lefties, he's going to go with Pizarro. Uh, the right, he's going to go with Stewart. So I think he's going to go with the young arms. Hopefully they can they can hang and keep this workload being up. So uh, I think it's going to be a combination of the two of them. Mark Kevin McAlpin, 97 positive. Thanks for coming on. Good. Thanks. Good. Good.